Yeah, YouTube, what's good, man? Yo, make sure y'all do me a favor, man. Like, comment, subscribe, and share this, man. Shorty's going bonkers, you heard? 100 pack on a fucking BBL is nuts. Well, let me let me see what's going on with this camera shit real quick. I don't... It's like... Eh, I guess. We're going we to rock with that like that. All right. Let's get into this, though. I have spent $100,000 on my body. Damn, Pinocchio. You're bugging out. For the adult right, industry. Good. She still looks... I always knew I wanted to have plastic surgery. Always? And I always wanted a bigger butt. I Yo, wild women... Yo, I ain't gonna lie. Dropping a 100 pack is crazy. It's a <laughs> hell of a... Hell of a... Hell of an investment, you heard? Wild women like that fake be getting their bodies done why they always got these stupid ass Dolan dogs strings. i always knew i wanted to have plastic Pe surgery and Pe i always wanted these little furry ass like i don't know what to call these shits these little hamster dogs bro little rat shits a bigger butt i probably say i regret getting butt injections yeah, a little bit just crazy. because of the dangers of it but um oh shit that's the only surgery? There's no way she spent on only a hundred, a hundred pack on just the, the, the cakes. That's it. I mean, it's her body. I'm just, I'm, you feel me? I'm just trying to make it make sense. Cause it looked like it's been a little bit of work done somewhere else. You know what I'm saying? Not that it matters. I still, I ain't even going front to y'all niggas. I would still, you know what I mean? She would still catch the block of thighs. Niggas would bug the fuck out in her shit. Not even going front to you. But was it worth it? <clears throat> There's some butt shots. Them shit's crazy, son. They hitting you with the Thorazine. You going under, boom. Then they hit you with the fucking petroleum or some shit. What the fuck is that shit? It's some artificial fattening. Pause. I don't like the way that I'm doing my hands. I'm gonna just stop. But like, it's some freakery, man. Some trickery. Hopefully, she get that shit taken out. That shit ain't it. It's made me a lot of money. So in a way, I regret it. In a way, I don't. Mm. When I'm out and about, I always get people staring. Damn. Um, especially at my butt. I'll man duh <laughs> the fuck you spend you ain't spend 100k for people not to look the ladies look just as much women, as women's trust families everybody <laughs> face hi i'm tight. lisa Idis, and i have spent a hundred thousand dollars on my body oh, yeah, for the yeah. adult industry okay your body makes sense damn the lips look crazy son <sighs> Her lips look, them shits look like she could take them all. I think it's important to look glam, always look glam, because I think first glam impressions are everything. Glamorized. What glamorized. I probably love most about my look is my lips. I always knew I wanted to have plastic surgery, Where and I always from? wanted a bigger butt. Where's she from? I got my first procedure in 2013 in Argentina, and it was a Brazilian butt lift. And then I had my second BBL in 2015. My favorite procedure is probably the last one I had in March which I had a, another BBL in Colombia and Man, they did a hella different doctors niggas is made like niggas is manipulating the you know what I'm saying the cakes OD my question is what did you look like before love and where are you from excuse me pardon not that bad it's just personal I just really 360 really lipo this was what, three, oh, this is lipo ab etching fat transfer to my hips the whole experience um, was great. Colombia has to be my favorite place to get surgery. Wow. I probably say I regret getting butt injections a little bit just because of the dangers of Yo, it. But I didn't feel like doing a uh, Brazilian butt list so many times to achieve the size that I wanted because okay. it just meant that I would have to put on weight again, wait a year and then have another procedure. So I chose to you know, cut corners a little bit in both of the butt injections. But um, it's made me a lot of money. So in a way, I regret it. In a way, I don't. I, I started working God. in the adult industry yeah. when I was eight. Yo, how much brie she I think she made? Not that I'm not trying to pocket watch, but she put a 100K investment into the body. She's had to double that since 2013. 18 years old. I got introduced to it through music videos. I started working on TV doing live sex chat shows and I've been doing it ever since. My transformation has completely changed my fair. career. I was able to make a lot of money through OnlyFans, create a whole brand off of it. It was definitely the best investment I've ever made. The world. When I'm out and about, I always get people staring. 
Um, oh. Especially at my bar. Men, women, families, everybody. <laughs> I find the attention annoying sometimes. Yeah. I think when people look at me, they think that I'm very superficial, that I'm a bimbo, fake. My That's friends good. and family, Where definitely a bitch. See, lips look good right here. This some arms. You know what I'm saying? Mine look good too. Shocked right? and didn't quite understand. But once they okay. saw the, the reason the why I did it yeah, and the, the results of me doing it, the they understand. Like, oh, right. My family say, you know, that the so lips changed my expressions. They made me look more mature, I guess. That was her lips before? That's, the lips wasn't bad. Less innocent, that's what my mom would say. Every uh, time I see my dad, he always makes some type of joke about my lips. Hopefully it's non-sexual, because I ain't, I ain't gonna call, say nothing, but... I'm about to call my mom. We're gonna have an honest conversation about my surgeries. Um, she hasn't always been a fan, so it should be interesting. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hello. How are you? Hi. Very good. And you? Good. Good, good, good. Mommy, what part of my new look do you like the most? Your waist. Me too. Yes. Beautiful. Little. Yes. The smaller, the better. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Mommy, smaller what part better. of my body do you dislike the most? Mm. Your bum. I thought it was Your my bum. lips. No, your back because it's too big. I'm worried for your back, for your spine. My back already hurts. I'll reduce it one day. Dragging a wagon, you know what I'm saying? Carrying all that luggage, you know what I'm saying? The extraterrestrial weight. Shit can be, you know what I'm saying, obnoxious. You know what I mean? Word. I'm going to yes. reduce it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Promise. I, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, do you wish that I still had my old body and my old Old face? body sounds Honestly? crazy. Yes, honestly. Yo, yes. yeah, yeah. Old body don't sound crazy. Yes, because you were perfect. Oh, she was. She was valid. She was valid. Low, but low. Maybe a BBL, some shit from Colombia. She would have been if she wanted to get the tatas lifted. Some with the nose, Pinocchio shit she got going on. She'd have been. She's Gucci. It's not. Mom, what about you? Would you ever get plastic surgery? Hell no. She's. Cool. I have in the past, but no. Oh, what you get? Oh, because it was my choice. It's because I was ill. Do you have in mind another surgeries? Not now, but in the future, yes. Not now, it's crazy. After babies. Are she gonna get the mommy? My style has definitely changed. Some of the things I would wear now that I boutique shit, wouldn't have before surgery would probably be like the really tight fitting clothes that show my body. I think before I would be trying to hide so got the, the areas that um, I, wasn't the I was Millie. more insecure about. And now I like to wear things that are very yeah, tight fitting that shows my figure. Yeah, show still what you pay for. Some to imagination. Did she pay for like this. Memo. Some of my Memo. most luxurious items. Word. I just got this Givenchy bucket bag. It was a gift. I love gifts. I don't like spending my own money. <laughs> and they match the boots. So Givenchy hey, boots. This is a birthday gift for my 30th birthday. Cartier Santos. That's what it was. A, car a Cartier ice. This wow. only comes out for special occasions. Another favorite purse of mine would wow. be this. Tweed Chanel bag. She's so cute. I'm just something like that. This probably goes for oh, $5,000, $6,000. So I have a lot of clothes, but I spend most of my money on bags and shoes. Yeah. Online, I get a lot of positive and negative comments about how course, I look. I'm in the adult work industry, so a lot of my content For is, what? you know, provocative. I'm not wearing a lot of clothes, so people judge me based on. Yo, she like Mr. Meaty with the lips. I am wild. I'm not trying to shame. I'm, I'm going to get cooked. I'm just saying, though, the lips is probably a little D. What they see. I get positive and negative comments. Some not so nice ones. Where are so my natural women at? Hashtag man, not here. I, like, I have no idea I'm what you look like before shit, you had that done, but I guarantee you look better then. Some leave me some very, very nice comments. Yeah. Glamorous queen, flawless wonder woman. This one is... Uh, a love note. He always leaves me these paragraphs on every post that I post. I've learned over time what that it's usually people that have hate towards me and what I do and what I look. Yeah, nah, nah, no hate or nothing like that. But what y'all think about this, man? It's a level of insecurity. Do y'all think she's... I wonder if she really like, truly happy with herself, man. 
That's all I care. Like about. has nothing to do with me, and, shit, and I mean, it's a projection of how they feel about shit, themselves. Like that, so I don't take it personally kind of anymore. You know what I mean? So today I'm gonna go train with my boxing trainer Jason. I'm gonna go meet him at the beach. Fire. I train with him about four times a week, so this is regular program. Four times. I a started program? boxing for exercise at first to challenge myself is something that I'd never done before. And, you know, over time I started to take it more seriously. I don't really worry about getting hit in the face yet because I haven't actually had a professional fight yet. I sparred, um, but we wear headgear. So even though I've been hit in the face, um, just basically a little bit protected. So it's part of the sport, yeah. it comes with it, comes with the territory. Yo, hey! Uh, it's good to see you. You too. Ooh, let's go. Time to rock it. I love it. Yes. You're always up for the challenge. Always ready to go for it. Yes. Bam, get some. Let's go. Ah! <laughs> I think because, you know, boxing is a male dominated sport. People feel like women shouldn't be doing it, but I believe I that I can that. be feminine. My son in the back, get, get, his, get his fucking screen time and his mad. Sexy fun. and strong and a bad at the same time. To the haters that judge my body, nah. mind your business. Um, your work shit? on yourself, worry Just about yourself. Don't worry Good about life, what love. I decide to do with my body. It's my Word. body, it's my life, That's not yours. Man, hopefully, man, she is satisfied and happy with herself, man. What y'all think, man? Y'all ladies out there, man, how y'all feel about the surgery, man? Y'all getting y'all surgery done? What's too much? What's too less, man? Talk to the boy, man. What's, what's, what's the word? Man, but do me a favor, man. Like, comment, subscribe, man. I'm shystied up, man. So you know what that mean. I'm about to go, go crazy on the videos. Like, comment, subscribe, and share this shit with your auntie, man. You feel me? La abuela, I know. You know what I mean? Let them know. You know what I'm saying? Pap Papio, he dropped another video, man. Come rock with the kid.